All right, my mom's about to pick us up. So yesterday we pre-hooked up the trailer to the truck. Matthew blew up the truck airbags. So it's literally all ready to drive away. We're heading to the ferry for yeah. a stop. Toto's excited. We're all excited. We're all excited. Colorado, we're coming for you. Yeah, America, the great west. Renee, you have no idea what's coming for you. Yeah. Toto, what's I'm, happening? I'm so excited. Yeah. We're so excited, yeah. Good. Oh, good, good. Love you. Love you. Good morning. Good morning. Going to a one of two weeks. Love you. All right, we're officially on the road, heading off to the ferry. Day one out of nine to Colorado. How was the first tow haul? Oh, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a champ, you know? He is doing, you're doing really good. Yeah. I feel good with you driving. Toto's doing good. He's super, like, I mean, he... Toto's a travel dog now. I know, he never used to do road trips and he used to get super sick when he was a puppy. Now, he's not even stressed. Like before nope. he used to get so stressed, he's just like, oh, we're on another adventure. He knows the deal. He knows the deal. It's so great. I love it. I'm yeah. so excited. This feels surreal. We've been working towards this for months and months. Yeah. Actually, you know, I've been thinking about doing this for years. For a long time. Yeah. And I grew up RVing, so it was kind of like a full circle thing for me as well. But today's a big day because most days we're just driving, but today we have to catch a ferry and we also have to cross over into the United States because right now we're in Canada. So, and then our camp spot for the day is only about half hour past then. We have to get groceries, fill up the truck. Oh, uh, groceries and fill up the truck. <laughs> Almost in your home country. Yep, almost back in America. America. Porters always sketch me out. And they have like ultimate authority over you, like you can't be yeah, like. Yeah, and it's just a line in the ground. Like, yeah. Now you're coming on this other area and we need to know what's up. Okay, so we got all checked in, set up camp, and now we're gonna go do our big grocery haul. So we're gonna stock up on groceries for the week and then get home and enjoy. Yeah, we got the heat pumping in there so it should feel good by the time we get in. Our neighbor that is in an Airstream next to us has a freaking wolf. It just walked by. Wow, that it's the coolest thing I've ever seen, bro. I'm such a fan. This is the stuff that I'm the most excited about. Yes. It's just the random stuff that we see along the way. Cause you the know you're gonna, meet, meet. you're gonna meet interesting people in RV parks. Yeah. I was like, hey, can I, uh, can I come say hi to your wolf? And he was like, ah, no, he still has his balls. It's kind of dangerous. And I was like, what? He's like, yeah. He's like a full blown alpha wolf. I was like, at an RV park, nice. <laughs> We gotta try and make all of that fit in those. Look at this. Living. It's so exciting. I'm just so happy to finally be on the road and be on our way. Yeah, I got a nap in today even. You deserve that nap. After those tow hours, I'm here for you. Wow. And tonight is going to be the first night that we make ourselves dinner in the uh, RV. watch a movie. I wonder how much propane it's going to take to have the oven on for an hour. I'll Google it. It's learning. We're living and learning. Well. Well. Well, we're going to chill. See you guys on the flippity. Okay, good morning. It is officially day two. It's about eight o'clock. The sun just came out. Matthew's out hooking up the trailer because we did our grocery shop and detached yesterday. But today, we're hoping to get on the road early and just pump out these three hours. So I am in charge of packing up the trailer, making sure it's all ready to hit the road and everything's away. And Matthew's in charge of the exterior. So we're going to get this day going and get on the road. 
Day two, here we go. Getting ready to pull in the sides, everything is off the counters and everything. So I'm just gonna sweep because any little thing can mess up our slide in. So, very crucial. Okay, so my system that's kind of been working here is everything loose I put between the chair and the bed because the chair has to be moved from the office over here so it can all close up. But that makes it easy and secure. It's all right there. All right, we're all closed up. Lights off. All right, day two, we're officially on the road. Yeah. Thanks. Nice. You're such a freaking woman and I love you for it. Yeah. Always filling those gap, brain gaps of mine. This is a very cool way to experience travel. Yeah. Because you're on the road, but also you have your home with you. So like, there's a sense of familiarity with wherever you are, but also like in new places, which is really yeah. cool. I'm sure there'll be highs and lows, but right now it's just so much fun. Look how pretty this is. set up at the new spot spot number two this is a cool spot it's really crowded though lots of people fighting Whoa. over <laughs> yeah just us how fun how fun how are you doing let me let's get some of you in here what do you think i'm feeling great and it's gonna be a great night look at this we're in we're in freaking wonderland wonderland wonder totes we're in wonder totes this tree though come on come on tree come on tree that's a beautiful tree i think they call those weeping willows you're a weeping oh. willow all right we're on our first walk at the second spot at the second spot yep this is one thing i'm really excited about with rving is just spending more time doing this like look how beautiful that is this place is seriously so beautiful. Was the first walk first adventure so really good. so good i love that that river and i love that it's like so mellow here you know i know it's really nice mellow schmellow don't get caught in the smello <laughs> <laughs> back home sometimes love is a thought 